Hi guys, I'm Linda Perry with Fabulous Faces Entertainment and Balloons from Interlock in Florida. And I'm here with my friend and mentor, Joette, um, from ballooncoach.com. Um, she came out for the weekend and we were doing some kayaking. Isn't that great fun? So anyway, we want to give you a tour of my shop. Um, so this is a new rack system I have. I picked this up off Amazon. Um, the rack itself is around $100 if I remember correctly. And then you buy these um, little pegs that hook in. Now we did secure the pegs with little tiny zip ties as well so they can't go anywhere. Um, you probably really can barely see them up in there but they are secured in. Um, I love this rack. I love that I don't have to go dig through a, a plastic container to find my stuff so it's all organized by theme or type of balloon. And then all of our big ones are on this side. And I love that it spins around and that it can be moved out of the way. So, um, and that's what I'm gonna do right now, is slide that out of the way. And then this is our backdrop um, that we keep up. So anytime we get something built and it's ready for delivery, you know, the smaller pieces and stuff, we'll get a picture of it here. Um, and we also rent this out um, to our clients if they're doing, if they need like a photo backdrop, it will run an organic up this side and maybe another little piece of organic over there. Um, so, um, and this is professional pipe and drape. So you've got the nice base plates at the bottom and the metal coming up and over to make it nice and stable and the pocket sewn into the fabric. And Linda, tell us a little bit about the space that we're in. So um, this shop is a three-story house that we purchased, I don't know, eight or nine years ago, me and my husband, actually for our kids to kind of help them get started in life. And they lived here and took care of all the bills for the first eight years. And I moved in about a year ago when our last child moved out. So I have lots of great space here. Um, I did want to show you this about this pipe and drape for those of you who don't, haven't done pipe and drape. Um, I will eventually invest in the stuff that you can raise up and down. So this is eight foot tall, which isn't always tall enough, but this is what I like about it. If I want to change these curtains or put it up, I really can do it all by myself. So That's great. Different systems are set up different ways and many poles are not adjustable like that and they don't come apart. So you just have to check on your systems as you're ordering them. Um, so this is our inflation area over here. And um, uh, probably about a year ago, I was um, actually watching a live video with Liz Romani, who is um, one of the teachers and coaches in uh, Master Balloon Boss Mastermind. Um, and I was watching one of her videos and I saw her wall in the background. And I was like, that was the only question I had for her about that video is what are those hanging up in the background? So I really like the ease of getting them out. Um, there are some people that say they should be in sealed containers. So I haven't had any problems yet, but I'll have to keep an eye on that. Um, and so these are the shoe organizers, correct? Correct. And they're from, um, I get these from Walmart, the clear ones. So not always easy to find. And actually it's probably, well, it probably has been about a year because I think I started switching over this in the beginning of COVID. So, and this is our inflation area. Um, my ribbon rack, again, another idea from, um, my fellow Balloon Boss Mastermind friend, Liz Romani. And then I have notes up for my staff. So this is for like party poles when we were doing those a lot. And this is how many times they should pull the ribbon according to how many colors they pick off of there. So I don't have to constantly repeat myself. And we have the same thing for inflation settings. So for our Legenda, it just tells them if they're using an 11 inch on the large port, you know, if it's six inches at 0.4 and so on. So, um, we'll go right. on to the next area. Yeah, let's go to the next room. So you can see in here, I have really tall ceilings. So I don't like to do any kind of helium inflation out here. Um, although I'm surprised it's not something up there. And then this is our helium room with um, our extra storage and stuff. So, I love how you've got the labels on everything. Yes, very important so we can find things. That's all of our extra latex. So, um, and I do use an inventory app called Sortly, um, which is a real, it's an awesome app. You should check it out. Cool. And 
just the only other thing in here is the balloon stuffing machine. So I do do stuffed balloons. So that's in here. And then you keep all the extra plush and things downstairs in your storage there, yes, correct? Yes, <laughs> yes. So I do have a basement here. So all of my um, plush and um, yard cards and things are in the basement. All right. And then one other area that I love over here is how she's got things set up um, as a pool inventory for their events. Yes. So this is um, when... when Pre-COVID, we would use this aboard a lot. We haven't been using it so much, you can tell. But anyway, this is where our, these are our things that are going out. Um, we got something going out on the 29th or the 30th. They're flexible. Another on the 30th. And then we got one on March 4th. So that we go ahead and we pull all the inventory and have the order form here um, and a picture of the design. We do do Balloon Planet. Um, and as soon as I get the order, I pull the inventory. So if I need to reorder, I can, and I take it out of my inventory app. So that's how we handle that. Great. And where do we want to go next? I think, um, oh, up to, oh, where are we at? Um, to the office. Okay. I'm like, where, where are we? <laughs> so my office is upstairs on the top floor. And Linda, why is your office on the top floor rather than down where the work's happening? So that's what my staff wanted to know when we moved in. And I, I intentionally came up here so I could be alone. <laughs> so if they, it's gonna have to be really important for them to climb those stairs and bother me. <laughs> so this is my office space, which I really, really love. Um, I rearranged it. I got the silhouette cutting machine, the vinyl cutter. This is an older model. I've had it for at least five years. Um, does a great job still for what I need it to do. Um, we got all kinds of drawers and stuff we can move out and around um, whenever I need the extra space. And then here's my vinyl storage. I always buy, almost always, buy my vinyl in 12 by 12 sheets. I use brilliantvinyl.com. They're reasonable, they ship same day, free shipping. <clears throat> for orders over like $25 or something. And what kind of organizer is this hanging on the wall for the vinyl? So I got this at Amazon. Yes, I am a huge Amazon fan. Um, and I, I'm pretty sure that's like some sort of teacher storage for file holders. Wonderful. And so the 12 by 12s fit on that really nicely. And then yes. what is your favorite thing about your computer? So the dual screen, um, I switched over to that probably two years ago. And I actually, one of those is a TV screen that I had laying around that was extra. And um, so I just bought a rack and hooked it in and life is a lot easier working with dual screens. Yeah, I've had dual screens for about five years now and I absolutely love this. Yes, life changer. Well, great. So. Well, Linda, thanks for showing us around your space. Absolutely. It's great to see how you've got your office separate from your inflation area and things set up for reminders for your staff. Yes, absolutely. And I just, I just do wanna say a word. Um, I met Joette probably three or four years ago at Florida Super Jam, and um, she's super outgoing and always involved in, in talking with people, and she really helped me make some decisions at that time about where I wanted to take my balloon decor and what kind of you know, um, conventions and stuff I wanted to go to. Um, I was trying to decide at the time between world and float, and she's like, float, definitely float. So, um, and that, it, and I'm pretty sure she's already having her things, but that's what we talked about. And that's what I was asking her about. So she was super encouraging. Um, 2021 would be my fourth year going to promotions and profits. And it is such a valuable, intimate um, learning experience. So if you're interested in all the aspects, so how to build, how to do frames, how to do the business end of things, it is definitely the place to be. Um, and then the other place that I hang out and I've been a member of for at least two years is Balloon Boss Mastermind. Um, you, you just gotta go there, Joette, is a wealth of information. There's so much content. Um, adopt a grandparent is going on in there with all the stuff already done for you. Um, Valentine's, graduation, all of those things. And we're just all in there collaborating and sharing information. So great place to be. Thank you so much for your time, Linda. I can't wait to see you again at Balloon Boss Summit in Orlando coming up in November. And uh, hopefully we'll have some nice weather for us to go kayaking today. Yes. <laughs>